Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in this short video today, I'm gonna show you how to plot the position on the JRC Eclipse model Gen 9201. So before you start and you want the position more accuracy, you have to turn on the radar overlay function on the edits. So if you want to turn it on, you have to click on the menu, then you click on the view, then you select option. When this one appears, you select radar. On the radar, now you have to select number one or number two radar. Then you can turn it on. So after you turn on the radar overlay, you can proceed to, you know, plot the position. To do that, you click on menu. Then you click on tools. Then you click on the manual position fix. You can see this one. So actually there are three methods to plot the position. The first one is the bearing. So with the bearing, you have to get at least two fixed objects to do that. And the second one, the distance. With the distance, you also have to get at least two objects to plot the position. And the last one, the bearing and distance. You get one for each, okay? So let me show you one by one. So the first one with the bearing and distance. So you have to click on the fixed object and you have to drag your bearing to the shift position right there. Then you click enter, then you click set. So with distance, you click on the distance and you click on the same object then you drag the bearing as the distance to the shift position then click enter after that you click set then you click on the plot set plot position you can see that right so when this one appears you can input the type dr means very accuracy and ep mean low accuracy then you have to select the source viewer bearing and radar range then the clear you can see that this is the latest portion you know update and the second one that you have to do plot by the bearing so with the bearing you have to you know click on the first object then drag the position then you click enter then you click set then you select the second object you drag the bearing to the shift position again then you click set now you have to click on the plot then set position DR, sorts, bearing. So you can see this one, this is the latest one. Then the clear all light. So with the distance, you also have to click on the first object. Then you drag your range to the C position. Then you click set then you select the second object then you drag to a shift position then you click enter then you click set then after that you click on the plot set plot position and you also have to change direct then sort radar range so you can see this one also, the latest one. After finish, you can clear all light. Then you can stop that. So you can see this is three, you know, position update where I plotted. Okay. Okay, everyone, that's all for me. Thank you very much for watching. So I hope you can learn something from this video. 
and if you want to see more video please don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you and i'll see you soon